Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am filming the what I got for Christmas video. I actually love that on Christmas day, everyone is just so chill and so relaxed and happy and everyone's just eating a lot of food and it's just obviously all about being with the people you love. But one little tiny perk of Christmas is that sometimes if you're really lucky, those people that you love give you some beautiful gifts. And I just wanted to share that with you guys. I always love watching these kinds of videos after Christmas, just seeing what everyone got and, you know, hearing about everyone's day. Um, my Christmas day is always pretty chill. My dad comes around in the morning and we all have breakfast together and do the whole present opening thing. And then we just sort of like chill, like watch TV, like relax. We had lunch with mum here. We had some amazing seafood and like a cheese board. Cheese boards are like my favorite thing ever. Um, and what else did we do? Cheese board. Oh, I made like these pan au chocolate things with like puff pastry. It was amazing. Um, and then just chilled, put on a little bit, bit of makeup and went around to my boyfriend's place and we spent the afternoon and evening together. We just watched some movies and we watched Secret Life of Pets, which was so cute. So yeah, let me know in the comments below what you guys got up to for Christmas. I'd love to hear. I'm so sad it's over, but that's just what happens. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to show you is from my mum, and this is one of the Glass House candles. I think she gets me one of these, like, every year, but this year she actually got me one of the Christmas edition candles. This is called The Night Before Christmas, and it is Dancing Sugar Plums. Combines blackcurrant, plum, lemon, and lavender to remind you of everything that's magical about Christmas. I just love that, and how pretty is this box? It's beautiful. Um... I'm gonna, like, did my nail polish opening this. The candle itself actually looks beautiful. It's gold. If you guys have ever got a glass house candle before, they're usually just in a clear um, glass container. They're very, very good quality. This smells so good, and I've actually been holding off burning this. I'm filming this video on Boxing Day, which is the day after Christmas, and I really wanted to burn this last night, but I was like, no, hold off. Wait for the video, and you can show everyone in all its glory. So pretty. By the way, if you're wondering about the makeup that I have on right now, I just filmed my New Year's Eve makeup tutorial. And I'm pretty sure that's going up before this video. I'm not too sure, but if it's up, you will have seen it. And if it's not, it's coming very, very soon. Next, I've got some makeup that my mum and my sister bought for me, which I actually picked out because these are kind of things that I wouldn't normally buy for myself. They're a little bit special, if you know what I mean. So I have a couple of things from Hourglass. Now I love Hourglass makeup. It is so beautiful, but a little bit more on the pricey side. So I picked up, I picked up, I picked up and they wrapped up and gave it to me. <laughs> the Hourglass Veil Primer. I'll take it out of its box. I actually just used all of this makeup I'm about to show you in this makeup tutorial. And I just, I'm lame like that. I put it back in its box so I can show you. So it looks like this. This is just a beautiful mineral primer. It is lovely. It feels very silky and hydrating on your face. And I love it. I've used this before, but it's just one of those things that I never really got around to buying again because it is so expensive. So it's a really nice gift to receive. And same goes with these, which are the Hourglass Ambient Powders. These are actually some of my favorite face powders ever. They give an incredible, incredible finish to your face. They just make it look so glowy but not like shimmery, shimmery, just glowy. I, d I can't even, I can't even explain. I got the shade Diffused Light, which is more, oh yeah, Diffused Light, which is more of a yellowy, pale yellow highlighting shade. Today, I just use this to highlight under my eyes and on the areas of your face that you'd normally highlight. Um, so I use it in the same way as like a banana powder, basically. Um, and when I'm really pale, I use that one all over as a setting powder. And then I also got Dim Light, which is more of a setting powder when I have a little bit more of a tan, which is what I used it for today. And then I got two things from Urban Decay. This is the Moondust Eyeshadow. Uh, <laughs> I just said that so weird. Moondust Eyeshadow. Um, these are really expensive, like for single eyeshadows. I think they're like $39 or almost $40 or something. So again, not something that I would normally buy for myself, but something that is a really nice gift to receive. And I got the color Solstice. So it's like a duochrome. I don't know if you can see, but it looks like 
pinky red in one light and then it's got like green reflex it is so beautiful and just a special eyeshadow i love it last thing i got is well, last thing i got from my mum and my sister is the heavy metal glitter liner in distort distortion distortion Distortion. I already have Midnight Cowboy, which you will have seen me use in my Christmas party get ready with me And I'm obsessed and they only sell four colors in Australia They sell the gold which is Midnight Cowboy the silver the dark blue and this one which is like the white era Like can we just can we just take a second? I'm gonna show you guys this close-up Look at that Focus focus focus. Thank you. Do you see all this glittery goodness? Little spoiler alert, that is what this is. From my nan and pop, I got some cash money and from my dad, I got some cash money. My dad is also really cute and he got this mug made for me. I unwrapped it and I was like, what, what is this? And he's so cute. He got this mug made for me. I think it's off one of those websites where you can go on and like look at your Instagram and get a couple of pictures on a mug so he got this one which is actually one of my personal favorite selfies I've ever taken so good choice dad and he got my name on it and then this picture was taken on my 21st birthday this year and got Hales written on it which is like what everyone who's close to me calls me um, so yeah I just thought that was really really cute and sentimental that my dad made that got it made for me and now I have a new coffee mug to drink my tea out of in the morning that didn't make sense next is something I am so excited about so my boyfriend ordered me um, a whole heap of Smith brushes I don't know if you guys have heard of Smith cosmetics but they are I've never tried them so I can't really say they're incredible but I've seen a lot of youtubers using them and they look amazing quality brushes and my brushes are kind of like falling apart because I've had them for like three or more years and he knew that I really needed new makeup brushes so he bought me a whole bunch of Smith brushes and they obviously haven't arrived in time he ordered them way too late but that was fine with me I knew that they weren't gonna be here for Christmas so they haven't arrived yet but let me know if you want me to do like a first impression or Smith haul and I can show you each brush up close and all of that and I told him not to get me anything else because if you know Smith brushes they are very very expensive he is such a Christmas fanatic and he was like no I really want you to have something to unwrap under the tree and I was like it's fine like I'm gonna have gifts from other people it's it's all good but he couldn't resist and he bought me this really nice adidas track set so these are tights they're tight on your legs and they have the let me, let me just get this they have the adidas logo around both ankles so one on this leg and one on this leg um Look out for a selfie with these on Instagram because that was all I could think of when I when I unwrapped this. I was like, that's gonna look really good on Instagram. So he bought me those and then like a matching top to go with. So it looks like this. God, this is so hard to show on camera. So it's got the Adidas logo and then the classic Adidas stripes down the shoulders. And yeah, it's he got this one really big because this is a size 12. He knows I like my shirts really baggy and not tight. And the leggings are in a size 8 and they are really, really tight and snug and all of that jazz. The last thing I have to show you is the gift that my boyfriend's mum bought for me. And I had no idea what this was. I think it was the biggest present I had under the tree and I was like, what, what, what is that? And when I unwrapped it, it was in like a, it's like dust bag, but I've taken it out now. And I don't know if that got thrown out with the, uh, the Christmas wrapping. It's a bit concerning. I should probably go look for that. Um, but she got me a guess handbag. I really needed a new handbag and I really like this one. It's really sturdy and structured so I can fit a lot of things in there. I feel like it's a really, really good size to take to work or if you're going shopping for the whole day and you need to have a few things in your bag. And I love that it has a big strap on it as well so you can kind of carry it on your shoulder because I... I really can't carry bags like this around unless I'm just like walking from like here to here. But if I'm going around all day, which I normally do when I have a handbag with me, I love to have a big shoulder strap. And the inside, I've kept all the stuffing in there because I just like to keep things in their packaging for as long as possible. But I'll show you, it has really beautiful kind of like 
faded leopard print interior and I love it. I think this is such a beautiful present. So to all of my family who is watching, thank you so much. Like I feel so, so spoiled. And even though um, Christmas is obviously not about receiving presents, it's really nice to receive things from people that love you and know you so well and just buy you beautiful things that you will always kind of cherish and remember that you got for Christmas. Am I making any sense? Anyway, probably not. I'm, I'm getting really rambly, I can tell. So I think I'm just going to go ahead and wrap up this video. Um, but let me know what you guys got for Christmas below. Let me know what your favorite, favorite present was. And I hope you all had a great Christmas. Also, don't forget to let me know what you got up to on Christmas Day. I just love everything Christmas. And I was a serial vlogmas watcher this year. I love watching people's vlogmas. I think Tanya Burr has the best vlogmas. And I was also watching... Lily Pebbles vlogmas and Amelia Liana's vlogmas. I love how like Christmassy the British girls get. It's so, so fun to watch. Um, yeah, rambling, rambling. I'll see you all in my next video. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you like it and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Mwah.